Hi, and welcome back to our second video in our series on PLM. My name is Pete Edwards. I'm a PLM solution architect with Root Solutions. And today we're going to be looking at transforming your bond management. Now, interestingly enough, PTC has just released a white paper entitled Realizing a Digital Product Definition for the Enterprise. It's a really interesting and informative read. And if you get the opportunity, I thoroughly recommend downloading it and taking a look at it yourselves. One key phrase that PTC uses in their white paper is a complete digital product definition. Now that's exactly what we're trying to achieve in Windchill. We, like, we want a virtual representation of your product in Windchill. The key to this is the bill of materials. So today we're going to be looking at how organisations currently manage their bills and materials and then how Root Solutions through Windchill can help to transform your bond management. So let's take a look at a typical PDM design process. Many organisations still heavily rely upon their drawings for bond management and work instructions. Although they may have transitioned to PLM systems such as Windchill, it is still very much used in a PDM capacity. Product development is often very linear and conducted in silos. Downstream functions such as manufacturing and procurement wait for the engineering release of a drawing before commencing their activities. As the PLM system is often seen as an engineering tool, each functional area has its own system for managing and transforming the data. Okay, so let's take a look at some ways in which Windchill can transform your bond management. There are many areas where Windchill can help transform your bond management. PTC has listed 10 in its white document, which I mentioned earlier on. But today I'd like to focus on three where I found particular benefit for our customers. Parallel product development, configuration management and supplier part management. In the animation that we've just seen, the process is very linear. By implementing bond management and a part-centric approach in Windchill, when ready, the engineering team is able to promote their parts and bills and materials through a controlled release to a state in which downstream functions are able to access the data. This allows functions such as supply chain management and manufacturing to start planning for and designing their manufacturing processes. This approach also enables parallel product development and stops the waiting game. In the automotive, aerospace and defence sectors, it's of particular importance from a regulatory and compliance point of view to have a record of the bills and materials, their parts and documents as the product matures. For example, how did the product look when we designed it, manufactured it and shipped it? In particular, what parts and specifically what revisions did we ship to the customer? Windshield can help you achieve this through its configuration management, in particular using serialised part instances. Part proliferation is a problem for many companies, whether it's duplicating the same design or sourcing the same part from multiple suppliers. Through Windchill's part link module, Root Solutions can help your organization reduce its part proliferation. Parts link employs an easy to use web-based user interface that allows your users to search for parts based upon a classification attribute. So for example, show me all the M10 bolts that are in Windchill. Windchill Supplier Management will help your organisation to control where parts are sourced from through standardised workflows. It will also help to give your engineering teams visibility of long lead time items during the design process. I hope you found this video on transforming your bond management with Windchill interesting and informative. If you've got any queries or questions, please put them in the uh, comments box below. Or if you'd like any further support, please contact us on the details that are on screen. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.